I was uh, basically very much struggling with like how long I want to stay in journalism, what I want to do next. So I figured the best way is to try something that's not like reporting related, and that was the best way to get some volunteer work in without like fully committing to a new career. So that's why I was like, let me try this, and it has been many years since then. <laughs> We have monthly meetings.、Um, our, our board has monthly meetings,、um, and then we have a Slack channel that we are really active in. My role evolves more as being part of the board,、um, and that means that whenever we're like brainstorming events,、um, I will be part of the conversation, contributing ideas. Being in leadership is to be able to say like, yes, we had this plan, and then now we might need to address that plan because of things that are happening in the world that we need to be responsive to. How we talk about it at Philadelphia is like community building, not just among membership, but also community building opportunities with other journalists of color, different affinity groups, and also our local Asian American Pacific Islander. Communities. So, listening to members, listening to our board. You know, we have a bunch of folks who work at Seattle Times, but then there's folks that work in all sorts of other places. And so,、um, you know, getting, making sure that everyone is connected and on the same page when people have, you know, really different capacities and and、um, abilities to participate. Understanding like how to support that team and those humans, and how to, you know, delegate work and how、um, how to empower folks, you know, as a team, which you know just. You know, carries throughout your career.